Hello guys, Xanator here, and welcome back to Animal Crossing New Horizons. Uh, skipped the Isabel intro today because uh, there wasn't much going on. I did record it, but I decided, eh, she's just saying the same thing about her TV habits again. Uh, you know, classic Isabel. But I hope you guys are well. Uh, if anything goes funky in this recording, I'm trying, I have a stream deck now. Uh, so blame it on that. Uh, me trying things with the Elgato stream deck, it's really hard telling. I think I've set it up well, but at the same time, who really knows? <laughs> oh yeah, I got my thank you mom mug. There we go. Because I am a mother who needs to be thanked. Uh, so, let's, uh, what, 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 what we got here? <laughs> who are we and what are we doing? Uh, so nothing new in the way of that. We have, yeah, it looks like I've, yeah, I've gotten a fair few things. So, maybe I should head in the house and kind of... I uh, figure that out a little bit, uh, but if I was to say about uh, the things that my new stream deck can do, which this is something that made me very happy, and by the way, it's thanks to members uh, that I'm able to do this kind of thing, so thank you very much, members. Uh, I was able to, like, splurge on it a little bit and feel a little bit better about doing it than usual, and just the fact that there's more views and everything in general than usual, so thank you very much, but I can now do this, which is really fun. So... That little Twitter thing, that was love. So I'm able to do that love, which I think is really interesting. Uh, it makes me feel very professional. Uh, but there's a bunch of other stuff that I can test out. I just made that in uh, Premiere earlier and uh, put it in just to see how it would work. But uh, I think it's really cool. Uh, just that kind of thing. So I'm going to put this... Maybe I'll just throw it... No, no. I don't want to throw it in here. Uh, I might end up putting it in the storage for the meantime. Uh, the punching bag, we'll put in storage for now. Same with the den desk. Uh, the thank you mug, we will put out. I didn't mean to do that. Uh, did I put the... Oh, I put the dining table and the thing on accident. <laughs> That's the one thing I meant to keep out. That's fine. Alright, so I just want to take this down. Uh, because I kind of feel like having the retro dining table in here. I think it would be quite fun. Uh, so we're going to do just that. I guess i got to go to my inventory now, eh? Um, but we'll see what it looks like. Very blue. Dabba dee dabba die. Um, if I don't like it in here, which I'm not sure if I do actually, I can put it outside. And I do have, because I want to make a little, like, dining area outside. I do have this, which actually I think goes a little bit better with our style. Uh, so I think we'll actually go with that instead. And then... Uh, I almost feel like I need this just for the size. <laughs> it's so much smaller. Um, do I want to put anything, like, fun on top, or, uh, like, I mean, I already have the dishes, obviously, and stuff like that. Um, but I'm thinking maybe, well, we do have the, uh, the dinnerware still. I guess that's always uh, a good option, although there's empty space there for that, because, so why not? Maybe we can put, like, um, we have the placemats and stuff like that. That could be fun. Uh, I've not been able to actually place things like this properly yet, so... It'd be nice to kind of get more room to do this. The annoying thing is how much room the placemats truly take up. Because that's, that's a lot more room than I feel like it needs. Like, I wish I could just fit a mug, like, right here. Like, that would fit. Well, you gotta do this to me. <laughs> uh, I don't know if I have, like, an ironwood chair or anything like that. I don't really think I have much in the way of chairs other than this antique one. Um, which, yeah, I mean, you can only get it so close, which is, all, again, kind of a shame. Um, you know, I may actually end up being better off, like, having, uh, the front room eventually as a kitchen, because I think it's going to take up most of the room, to be honest, but, uh, I guess we'll do that when we get there. I'm going to go ahead and put these out as well. I realize I don't have a sink in here. That's about awkward for a kitchen, isn't it? Yeah, there's a little bit. Uh, so let's store that, and I'd rather have that there. Uh, microwave being out there, I think, makes a bit more sense. Can I push this forward just like a touch? No? Okay. It's got to be, like, right on the edge, almost hanging off. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, <laughs> but I think that's fun, maybe. But there we go. We have a place to eat now. I mean, I'm not even... I don't even know if I could touch anything from there with my, my little arms, but we'll make it happen. Uh, alright. So I've got the hibiscus uh, starts as well if I want to do anything with that. Um, I'll go and put that in storage. And uh, yeah, let's go see what uh, what we're up to doing today. Um, hopefully, 
something fun and fruity and fair. <laughs> I was trying to think of something that rhymed. I had nothing there. Um, but yeah, uh, um, I'm still so surprised, honestly, of how things are doing. Um, it kind of blows me away. Uh, and if you can't tell, I just woke up. <laughs> uh, well, I woke up about an hour ago. But uh, having a, a rough morning because I had a pretty... Oops, that's all I meant to do today. Wow, that was perfect. Can I still hit it or is it done? Oh, I can. Oh my god. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Again, rough morning. I'm glad that wasn't the money rock. But uh, no, I woke up with a pretty bad migraine. It's just kind of uh, dissipating now, so... Uh, a wee bit tired, but sort of making my way into the day. Um, that's kind of the issue. I went well on my first walk yesterday in a very long time. Uh, since the whole, like, uh, I guess pandemic started in a way. Uh, so that's been fun to kind of uh, get a little bit of outdoor, uh, like, fresh air and everything. But the issue was, there were so many people walking that it was hard not to be close to people. And again, being someone at risk, I just had to walk in the middle of the road at times. Um, so, probably not going to do at least that area again. i uh, got to find a little bit better of an area to walk. Uh, eventually, find a good place for it, who knows. Um, ooh, gold. I do like gold. It's got to be said. But I hope you guys have been well. I hope you're uh, doing well mentally and physically and everything through all of this. Um, I... I'm feeling minus the, the headache just from allergies. I'm doing pretty good. Um, you know, I've been obviously, you know, just keeping myself busy playing this, so everything's been fine. Uh, oops, <laughs> just a little smack of that. I really enjoyed uh, actually. Uh, I really enjoyed May Day yesterday. My wife ended up uh, telling me that you could actually reset uh, the maze, which obviously Wilbur told me. I just didn't listen or read properly to see so. Um, so I could have reset and got the last of the uh, bell vouchers. But to be honest, I wasn't that bothered. I think she said she got 21,000 in total. I got like 12. That's fine by me. Um, and I've been thinking. Uh, I don't know if I want to do the stock market again. Because if I do the stock market again, I'm going to have to sell at someone's place again. Which means probably more than one trip. Because two, I would have too many of them now. So I'm thinking I'll just invest a portion of what I have, maybe like 200000 and then, you know, start, um, you know, actually working on uh, getting my house, uh, oops, I must have missed, getting my, like, house payments in order as well. Uh, because, you know, I, I think I would like to go ahead and get my house maxed out, because once I got that done, I really have no financial obligations to a degree, uh, and I think that could be quite fun as well. Um... And another thing I must admit, I've seen a lot of people's, um, you know, designs in their island. Uh, and they use the mountains or the terrain tool uh, for the cliffs and everything. They use it like in so many different places I never thought of. Like they'll use it, you know, even like down towards the bottom, not just, you know, back here in one area like I have. Um, and it looks so nice and there's like so many cool things you can do. So I kind of want to play around with that soon. Um, just because I think it could look really nice if I do it correctly, or even if I do it incorrectly, I can eventually fix it. Um, but, oh, there goes my shovel. But I kind of like the idea of just making things really, uh, look really drastic now. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm already doing, like, the, the prim and proper side of things, so I feel like kind of going for the fully drastic side would be very fun now. Um, but who knows? We'll, we'll see. Uh, I love how it looks, and I love the, the natural look, but at the same time, uh, I'm, I'm not above <laughs> doing some other things. Uh, let's go ahead and see. I see a wrestler. Is that a server rack? That is. I mean, it's really cool, but... Why? Oh, <laughs> uh, alright. Did they change the outfits? Because they look different today, I don't know. Uh, let's see, I have these to sell to you. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and sell you this wasp nest. And, uh, I think that is good. Uh, so how much are you offering? 6400 don't mind if I do. Uh, yeah, so this is indeed a server rack, right? Uh, server, yeah. 
hundred thousand pounds. I'll pass. I mean, it, it, if I wanted to have that and like the cameras and then like some other stuff, I could look like I'm a really, really um, paranoid person in the world. But I don't. I'm not quite there yet. Uh, I am gonna get that start now because that is adorable. Definitely want that. I've not seen that one yet. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get the design shovel or printed design shovel. Uh, I don't know if I need anything else right now, uh, but it's always worth a little look. Uh, anything here? What is that? Blue paint flooring. That's fun. Concrete flooring. Cute white towel. Ooh, that might be fun for the bathroom. I will take that. Because I like everything looking a bit more modern, so I think that'd be fun. Um, but yeah, so the little stream deck thing, I set it up a little yesterday. And uh, it's really funny. So Zach made fun of me uh, for buying it because it was I bought it after we talked about it, and he was like, Ugh, "It's stupid. It's overkill. Why would I ever want that?" And then I bought mine and started using it uh, yesterday. And then I kind of told him about it and like what I set up for it to do. And um, he said many expletives of <laughs> me enjoying something, being funny, of course. Um, but uh, after showing him that I could basically make my own outros and stuff like that, uh, because I have a thing now, uh, which I'm going to try at the end. I can't press it now because it will end the video. Uh, but it's a thing that is uh, just a tiny slide, like a quick like, credits thing uh, that actually thanks our members. So uh, it's got everyone's name on it. I had to manually write it out, but it's not that much of a pain right now. Um, so yeah, I was able to do that and that's really cool. Um, I just got to double check, make sure I've not missed anyone, uh, because, uh, that, that is always a, oh, that might be a bit far. Ooh, okay, that works. Uh, because there's always a possibility, so, uh, I'll either run that at the end, or maybe, maybe, maybe I should double check it first, because I feel like I may have actually missed something. <laughs> uh, so maybe I'll run the next time, but yeah, I have the ability to do that now, which is super cool. Um, nail art set, I keep getting that one, that's very odd. Uh, I want my shovel here. That's not what I'm meant to do. Uh, <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm really excited to like be using it more and everything. And um, in general, just be able to... Uh, um, I don't know, just kind of make the videos better without having to edit them quite as much. Uh, or, well, you know, edit them at all, but make them better in general. And it's going to help when I'm streaming. Uh, I've got some lots coming in. Uh, I've got... Uh, which this is like mid-May at this point because you know everything's delayed right now uh, But I've got lots coming in. Oh, I've got a balloon uh, <laughs> Not coming in but just right here, uh, but I, I've got that I've got uh, A new desk that I'm that's not a slingshot. I didn't pay attention. I got a new desk that I'm building uh, Coming in hopefully in the next couple of days. It was supposed to be here yesterday, but still not even shipped out It still says it's gonna be here on May 1st though, so I guess I'm all good. Uh, sprite costume. Is that like what I'm thinking? Yes. Yes, it is. Well, I'm wearing that today. Uh, <laughs> uh, and then I've got, um, I got a brand new chair. Uh, I ended up just buying all this stuff on my own. Uh, I was going to originally, uh, I was originally trying to find someone. Look at Grizzly over here enjoying the flowers. I was originally trying to find someone who, uh, you know, may want to work with me and uh, get me a standing desk and me, uh, you know, work with them uh, sort of in a sponsory way uh, because I've done that before and it's always worked out quite nicely. Um, but they, uh, I could never, like I wasn't getting a lot of responses due to the current situation, I'm sure. Uh, and my patience is very thin. Uh, <laughs> so I ended up just going ahead and uh, making my own work around, which honestly I think is going to be better. Because uh, now I've got exactly what I want. It's not a standing desk, um, but I did buy a more comfortable chair. Uh, and if it's good, I'll tell you about it anyways. Uh, if it's bad, I'll also tell you about it. <laughs> oh, a double one. So we got the two bits of furniture today, so that's great. Um, so there we go. And after this video, uh, which it'll be coming up either before this video today or well, probably after. So I guess you can watch it next. Uh, I'm going to be uh, uploading a video uh, and recording, of course, a video for the Sanrio cards. Uh, so I'm going to be checking all those out uh, and getting the posters and stuff like that. 
And because I'll be able to order the posters in, um, I think I'm going to um, just go ahead and if any of my members want any of the posters, because I mean they are very exclusive posters, uh, because you had to have the Sanrio card sets and they're selling like each card's like a hundred some dollars. So technically beside me I have about nine hundred dollars I guess. Oh god that's terrifying. Um, but uh, you know if you want uh, some of the Hello Kitty posters or whatever, you know, Sanrio posters, uh, whatever they are, I've not fully seen them all yet, uh, feel free to tell me, uh, and I will, uh, get your friend code, uh, through, or I'll give you my friend code through a members only post or something like that and be able to, uh, to, uh, trade with you and everything, or not trade with you, I'll just give it to you, <laughs> you're already paying me, so thank you. Uh, so yeah, that'll be something that I think I definitely will do. So there we go. We got the money rock for the day. Uh, this will this get us over a hundred thousand? Uh, not quite, but we're getting close. Uh, we're doing pretty good in the way of uh, finances, which is always fantastic. Um, but yeah, I think another thing I may hello. <laughs> Thank you for patiently waiting. Another thing I may consider is actually doing uh, a little bit of uh, rearranging of the uh, the forest, like I said before. And I'm not even sure, after I get this next batch of fruit up here, I may even consider just... Ooh, hello. Are you just a jewel beetle or what are you? Uh, you are... A jewel beetle, okay. Uh, but I may even consider just taking the fruit, planting a lot of it, selling the rest, and cutting down all the trees. Um, because then this gives me, you know, a lot of room to work with, uh, to make my football pitch, to make, like, so many other different things. And I really want a way, um, because I've seen how people have made a path to their secret beach, and I really want a direct path to my secret beach. Um, obviously that makes a bit of a problem because I'm cutting the map in half and there's no land bridges. So I need to figure out some way around that. Um, but that's kind of okay. Like, I guess I, if I just build it, I'll eventually figure it out and, you know, be able to make my way around. But speaking of, uh, Red, I guess we should see if he's here today. Uh, not today it looks like. Uh, not had him in a couple days, so I don't know how often he's going to be here. I'm sure he's here more some uh, for some than others, but... Uh, yes, I will swap it. I will swap it with... Um, let's see. The rabbit... No, I like the rabbit tea. I don't want to leave it up here on accident. Uh, I'll just swap it with the, the clump of weeds for now. Although those are a lot more valuable to me now. <laughs> Because I now know that they make uh, the hedges. And I do love the hedges, as you guys know at this point. Uh, it's just one of my favorite things now. Um, oh, look at him being all cute. But yeah, I feel like I've got like so much to do in the game and so little time sometimes. But I know that I have like all the time in the world. I think it's like trying to, to figure out what I can do within uh, an hour of playing sometimes. Um... Which is another thing I should mention. So I now have on my little stream deck, uh, I have a pause button. Uh, so because of having the pause button, if I want to be like, oh, I'm just going to gather fruit real quick, I can pause it and then hit unpause when I'm done. And the recording just keeps going. I don't have to edit that out. So I think that's a huge thing. I meant to hit assess fossils. I was too busy talking about my stream deck. You know, things happen. Um, yeah, baby, I get it. <laughs> um... But yeah, and um, like I said, I'm going to visit my wife's island soon. Uh, she's got a five-star island now, so we're going to check that out uh, once she uh, has it a little bit more finished. Uh, because I think she's getting in there with her house and everything, so I'm excited for that. Um, I've already seen, you know, a bit of it. She's got so many, like, beautiful stalls and everything like that, so... And she's got, like, the hats with food on it, which are really, really cool looking. <laughs> uh, so I think that would be really fun to kind of check out and everything like that. And uh, it seems like everyone's very excited at uh, the fact of me maybe playing uh, Stardew Valley. So that's always a good pet. I've actually gotten a lot of comments, people catching up on that video today uh, and watching that. And I guess I mentioned it yesterday too, didn't I? 
Yeah, I think I did, so. Uh, kind of two videos in a row. Hey, Tipper, what's up? Uh, so I want to sell... Uh, make sure I didn't have anything T-Rex related. T-Rex torso, okay. Well, there we go. We're getting a little bit closer uh, to what we want. I don't like the fortune telling stuff, to be honest. So I'm going to go ahead and sell that. Uh, so yeah, we got to make sure to keep uh, that one most definitely. But the rest can definitely go ahead and go. Uh, I believe that is us good. Thank you kindly. <laughs> 20, wow, 25,500. Don't mind if I do. I enjoy when I have to have excess bells in my pocket. <laughs> it's a good time for me. Very, very much. Alright, so. Uh, I guess let's go put this down. See how much more room this is going to take up. Because I, I really... I am not sure. I feel like this is going to be a uh, big... Uh, Chungus, basically. Oh my god. Alright. That's fun. That's fun. <laughs> so I don't know if I need, like, a, the neck or the head next. I guess it's, like, a neck. I don't know if the neck and head is, like, you know, one big bit or not. But I think that's going to look so cool when it's there. So I'm very, very content about this. Uh, so I only need one more bit to make this kind of flushed out. Uh, but I think that will look so cool. Terrifying, but cool. Uh, <laughs> and then I'll get to take a really cool photo with, um, you know, a T-Rex. So, I mean, honestly, how could I lose? Um, oh, yeah. Able Sisters. I almost forgot to check them out uh, today. So, let's do that. I say almost. It's I'm only 21 minutes in. <laughs> Coffee. Uh, that's one thing I've not had enough of today, of course. Uh, there's kind of like the uh, female like pink Power Rangers uh, suit there. There's like a Jason mask. Uh, kind of like a Fitzy. Hello, we've been having more and more hot days lately. Summer is just around the corner. Probably time to get on my collection of summer aprons. <laughs> ah, you're adorable. Alright, let's see what we have today. Hopefully something fun and new, but we shall see. Um, Let's see, we got... Yeah, so the Noble Zap outfit, or suit rather. Oh, Painter's Coverall. That is really cool. I might actually go for that one. Um, I kind of like that color. Oh, that and that. <laughs> I am an artist. Um, Mummy Mask. I mean, in general, that's just kind of fun. Hockey Mask is just terrifying. Um, but as well, I mean, if I visit Zack wearing that, that would be fun. Uh, you know, just putting that out there. Maybe like my full white outfit can be that. Ooh, I could do house slippers though. That's terrifying. Hmm. I think it's all about the house slippers. Don't mind if I do. Oh yeah, let's wear that out. <laughs> you know, I actually oddly like this. <laughs> I can't lie. Um, yeah, that's, that's perfect to me. And she's just creepily behind me. Okay. <laughs> Oh, that's so good. Perfect. <laughs> um, but yeah, like I've been, um, like, I mean, the thing is, like, I spent probably all day in my office yesterday just, like, planning uh, some other stuff and doing some, like, other kind of behind-the-scenes work. I've been working on the Discord, uh, which isn't that much effort. It's just remembering to do it. Uh, and I've been working on, like, uh, some other things, so, uh, I think it's been taking a lot of my, uh, mental capacity the last couple days, so I'm definitely gonna, uh, spend, I think, tomorrow, just record one video and chill a little bit. Uh, I, th I think I could definitely use it at this point. Uh, but, I've, I mean, I'm, like, I'm still very, like, energetic, uh, all things considering for, like, how little of the way of sleep I've been getting properly. Uh, which is no fault of recording, to be honest, and working. It's, um, just been struggling to keep on a good, uh, pattern lately. I don't know why. Uh, it feels like when I was, like, I don't know, 18. <laughs> I, like, used to struggle like this. Not when I was 26, but, I don't know. Uh, but apparently when I hit 26, that's when my sleep wanted to get all funny again. Uh, so I do want to kind of keep this tree thing continuing. But it's actually really hard to see uh, because of all this here. So I'm just kind of wondering. I guess that's right. 
I mean, I'm just, I guess, going for what I, I can consider right at this point. And then there would be one here. Well, actually, I think there's a gap, isn't there? It'd be like that, yeah, because I'd need to be able to walk through. And I'll move these other trees, so that's fine. Um, but I kind of realized I could, you know, kind of just start this now, so this isn't such a bad thing. Now, I don't know if these will grow here because they're already close to grown trees. I don't know if that's actually something that affects it. It kind of feels like it is. Uh, so we'll, I guess, see how that uh, fares for us. Uh, let me go up here real quick and grab some of these peaches. Uh, I'm going to eat them to be able to move a couple of these trees. And maybe I might break the rock. Um, not like Dwayne the Rock Johnson, but maybe. Um, but I'm going to break the rock so I can uh, kind of get it out of the way to be able to um, not have it lost in trees. Because I will never find it. Uh, I mean, I could build around it. But at the same time, like I'll forget to come back here. <laughs> Just eating through a hockey mask as you do. Nom, nom, nom. And we'll go ahead and do this. Uh, but I think this should work, maybe. <laughs> Not a lot of confidence here, but I'm pretending that I got it. So there we go. We can take that. Uh, then we can just rip this on up. Which, uh, another good thing is I could actually just... I mean, these are fruit trees, so I can just replant them over here if I would so desire. Uh, so, I mean, that's also fun. Maybe that's what I'll do here. So I can plant that one there. And saying that, I mean, I could just move the trees from up there to down here. That is also always an option. Um, you know, it's a bit more, I guess, tedious of an option, but it is an option. Uh, but it's always... Uh, a possibility. I would need a lot more fruit, though, to be able to do that, I think. Uh, just for uh, the ability to do it right now. So, yeah, if I wanted another one, it'd have to be right here. And right here, so it's not very ideal. Um, granted, I can just eat some more of this for um, the future progress. Or I could just cut it down. That's always the thing I could do, too, and then plant this one. Um, I guess if I eat this one, uh, because I'll be able to move the tree, get three, uh, it would actually end up being a better return on a quicker pace, because I don't have to wait like three days for it to grow. So I think eating the fruit, even though I can't sell it, it's going to be okay. And let's be honest, we're okay with money right now, <laughs> with uh, the old stock market helping us so much recently. So we can go ahead and take uh, these up. Uh, but I'm hoping this should be quite nice to have kind of like a nicer layout like this. Uh, it's, you know, it's it's one of those things that I think if I have it where it's all in one section, I can easily just get everything. It'll probably save me a lot of hassle um, mentally and <laughs> everything about wanting to gather it. Because if it's all in one place, I can't really complain too much. I mean, I can, but I shouldn't. Um, so... Let's, uh, I think this is just a money tree or something. I don't think it's that, like, a fruit tree, so I don't think it has much importance, but I am going to take it just preemptively. Uh, and I'm going to take this one as well, because it is not a special tree, which it did grow here. Uh, it was a money tree that grew that close, so technically these should be okay. Uh, so that's a good sign, at least. Uh, so yeah, let's go ahead and plant this. And uh, this one as well. I love that you can just pick up and plant a tree. It's such a good thing. <laughs> it saves so much time in the game than having to, you know, obviously wait for, uh, you know, God knows how long, really. Uh, I guess like three, four days, something like that. Uh, so I believe that's all the, yeah, that's all the tree trees that have on me. Now, I do have ten more pieces of fruit, so if I wanted to, uh, I can get more uh, to be able to keep building out that way. So that's always good. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and take this. Uh, also, now I think about it, I could almost build a path to red back here. Which I never really considered. I could just take out like a big chunk that uh, gives me a walking path back there. But who knows, we'll see. Um, yeah, I'll be very curious how much... I'll have to count how many trees there are here um, in total. And then see how many... 
I need down here to match how many up there in uh, price. I don't need it to be exactly the same amount. Um, it's just, you know, if I can get someone here, that would be great. Uh, just to make my life a little bit easier. Uh, I better go and eat these oranges, then I'll gain another space in my inventory as well. Which is always welcomed. Um, but yeah, we'll we'll figure out what we want to do up here. I think definitely like the football pitch. And I saw someone uh, on, or my wife sent me someone on Reddit or Twitter, one of the two, who had built a, a basketball court. And it looks so good. So I definitely have to go for that. Uh, my wife already got me the basketball hoop, so that's very easy to do, obviously. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and do this back here. I, the ones at the front are peach trees, so I'm not really... Oh, these are peach trees too. Okay, great. Um, but I'm not as particular of wanting the peach trees, to be honest. Um, I do want them still, but I'm kind of okay with having less of them because they are native fruit. Don't really feel like I need them. Um, but you know, we'll still have them about, I'm sure. All right, so I'm full. Let me go ahead and swap it with something so I don't have to bury that again. Uh, you know what? I will. Oh, and I can't just plant one of them there, can I? Dang it. Uh, let me just drop that for the meantime. There we go. Now, uh, we'll head back down here and place some of these in. Uh, the other two trees that I have, the hardwood trees, are actually just going to go, uh, to, I guess, one of the nooks because I'm just, or the nook leagues, because I'm just going to sell them. Uh, I don't really have a purpose for moving them anywhere else. I don't know anywhere I want them currently. Uh, so there's no real point in me trying to put it somewhere, I guess. Uh, so. Here we go. Uh, I may keep, like, some peach trees, obviously, because I want to make sure I have all the fruits. Um, but I may, or I'm definitely going to end up keeping them, but I might keep them in a little separate area and basically have them as, um, oh, not too close, uh, but basically just have them as like a food source, like when I need, uh, this kind of thing. So I don't have to waste the, the bigger ones. Um, maybe if I do just right here, I can, I can justify putting a peach tree at the front so I can see what it is. And then there we go. That would be nice and easy. Uh, so let's go ahead and... Ooh, you look very different here. What are you? Yes, I caught a great purple emperor. It's purple rain is over now. <laughs> very, very interesting. Uh, so just to save us going in, I'm going to go ahead and sell just these two trees. Because uh, I don't really have much more. And I'll go ahead and sell that plant. Uh, and I think that's literally it. So I'm not really going to... <laughs> I'm not really going for that much, so we're good. Uh, 416 bells will do me just fine. Uh, I do want to go ahead and give this to Blathers because I'm afraid I will either A, sell it, B, swap it, uh, or I don't know what C could be, but it's definitely messing it up in some way, shape, or form. <laughs> so, we're going to be safe for now. Uh, so here we go. Uh, you can... I can make a donation, actually, for once. I was like, hmm... But I was ready to assess fossils instead of actually gifting. Although I still may have uh, more fossils, don't I? Let me check with them. Or check my inventory. <laughs> I like the... He's still, he's still good to help. So let's see. Ah, okay. So I don't have any. Okay, good to know. Uh, I'm good. I'm glad there wasn't like a huge spill there to where I could just see if I had fossils on me or not. That was much easier. <laughs> so much appreciated. Um, but I think Zach and I are going to actually end up recording uh, something in the next little bit as well. I uh, don't know what yet, but we kind of decided just to maybe visit each other's towns, see what they look like. I've still not seen his yet. Um, still not even started editing the thing that I'm supposed to be editing at this point. Uh, so <laughs> definitely got to start on that soon. Um, but yeah, I'm excited nonetheless to kind of see like what he's been working on and uh, how his place looks, and maybe steal some of his ideas, or he can steal some of mine, vice versa. Um, but yeah, it would be interesting, because I don't really know his creativity level when it comes to building and things, so it would be interesting to see. I mean, I played Minecraft and stuff with him, and he was always pretty good in that, but he was also quite simple and actually uh, did most of his... <laughs> pretty stuff so it's hard to tell I'll be curious to see what it looks like so I guess I'll get a little glimpse of that today as I'm editing and uh, be able to look into it a bit uh, by the way I'm going ahead and eating all of these 
uh, because why not, I guess. Uh, so that is none. And how many spaces do I have? I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. None. <laughs> there we go. Uh, hopefully my shovel can last for this. Uh, I'll go ahead and... What's that? Oh yeah, I literally just put that down. I'll go ahead and start uh, stealing off this back row. And this as well, why not? But uh, I think, you know, just... I kind of like the... Oops. I kind of like the whole thing about this game where you can not, you know, you can just kind of justify not keeping it the same, oops, all the time. Like, if you want to change something, you can just go for it. <laughs> just see what happens. What's, you know, it's kind of like, yeah, what's the worst that can happen? You just have to build it all back as it was, whatever. Uh, and I kind of love that. There's a lot of uh, freedom in this game that um, definitely had in no other Animal Crossing, most definitely. Uh, and it's it's quite nice to be able to have a little bit of uh, creativity. I've seen what kind of bug that was. It's nice being able to like let loose a little bit of creativity and uh, kind of makes you think definitely a lot more. Oh, these were peaches. I didn't even realize. Oh well. I guess that's the problem moving on when uh, you can't see what the, is actually in them right now. But uh, granted, I mean I'm not going to complain if I have peaches here. I mean they're my native fruit and they're delicious. So. Uh, that too. <laughs> Is that too far out? Oops, that's all I meant to do. Let's see if I dig that way. Okay, I think that's right. I was just making sure before I committed there. Right, and probably can't build here because of the cliff, uh, but that's fun. And then we'll just keep uh, digging on back here. And uh, I won't bother that as of yet. Uh, I mean, it's not a money tree or anything, so I'm not too fussed, but uh, I don't think I have any more fruit to eat to take that one out right now. Uh, so I'll just have to leave it be for the time uh, being. Uh, so let's go ahead and plant this. Uh, we'll just put a little row of, I guess, uh, peaches here. Or uh, two rows, but that's fine. There we go. So this is basically a, a, an episode of tree moving. I mean, I guess we're not always going to have like the most uh, uh, thrilling episode in the world. Uh, but honestly, I enjoy this kind of thing. I enjoy just sitting down and talking to you guys, and I hope you do too. Um, I forget. I keep forgetting to ask at the beginning of episodes to ask me questions. But if you have some questions for me, you can leave them in the comments. Uh, and I will uh, try to answer them in uh, the next video. Uh, just kind of chat with you and everything. Uh, I'm just going to quickly shake this. Thank God there was no bees. Uh, and then I'm going to switch to my axe. <laughs> because this is not a fruit tree, I'm fairly certain. So it's going bye-bye. And then I think it was an old money tree. I did not want to do that, I'll be honest. <laughs> I think it was an old money tree, so... We can uh, go ahead and let it, let it go for now. And uh, I'm just going to, I guess, see if I have any more fruit around to be able to eat. Wow, this is quite a dense little forest now. Uh, I will catch him, but, you know, I'm on a mission. <laughs> uh, I'm sure I've got some apples by my house, actually, that I can eat. Uh, and also, okay, yeah, they're all not in yet, but we do indeed have apples here. There we go. And I think I lose a, an apple here. Oh no, it actually goes towards the back now. I think I used to lose that one. So that's a lot better already. Uh, and ooh, what do I have here? Uh, oh, my wife sent me something. Beep. <laughs> and hi. Okie dokie. What are you, what, what, what'd you, what are you sending me? Uh, let's see. Uh, oh, Iron Garden Bench. And... Palm tree lamp. Ooh, that's perfect. Oh, I know that one. What? I didn't know I knew that one. But the iron garden bench I very much want. So thank you very much, Wafu. It's <laughs> all the cool kids say, right? Um, all right, and some uh, peaches, of course. We will always take easy sustenance. Kind of looks like it's going to rain. I really hope it does. Because if I could just have, like, 
even just a little bit of rain to help me with my flowers, that would be great. Anything to save me actual effort in the game, I love. <laughs> I keep forgetting that's there. Oh gosh, can I not get behind? Okay, there we go. I was just checking to see if there was a message in the bottle. Uh, doesn't look like I, I kind of forgot you could even send uh, recipes through the uh, through the post, so that's a good thing to know. So if I get anything fun, I can just send it to someone and see uh, if they have it or not. So yeah, I don't see it there, so that's fine. Uh, but we do have more fruit now, so we can actually go finish up at least the last few holes we have here. Um, and then, I'll, honestly, that makes me pretty happy just having some stuff moved. Uh, like I said, I'll maybe tediously off camera uh, count how many trees I have uh, slash have over there or have up here slash have over there where I've made the new area. Um, with it being so much more dense over there, I kind of feel like I've actually made a bet. I'll make a better profit uh, with less time. So that's the hope at least. Uh, but we'll see how it actually turns out in the end. Uh, so we're just going to, I guess, you know, take six more because that'll do us for now. Now that looks new. This I will take the time to get. So what is this? Uh, yes, I caught a violin beetle. Apparently I'm as fit as a fiddle. <laughs> That's a very, uh, my area saying. Uh, alright, let's go ahead and take this. Just, you know, casually dig some trees straight out of the ground, roots and all. Again, uh, might be the only game... Uh, that I can think that you can just dig up a full tree, but I gotta respect it. Alright. There we go. Beautiful. <laughs> Ooh, balloon. Even more beautiful. There we go. What did we get? Oh, we got full pockets. That's what we got. <laughs> uh, let's just drop that for the time being, just to see what it is. Uh, floating biotope planner. I keep getting those. Apparently, uh, I'm just really wanting to have all those, uh, according to the game. <laughs> Although they are cute. I just don't know what to do with them yet, or where to put them uh, to make them look nice, but we'll get there within due time, I guess, and find good places for them. Uh, I did make too much of a gap here, I just realized, like, for sure. But that's okay. Uh, we're only losing out on a little bit. Uh, and if anything, I might actually end up putting a ramp right here uh, to get up there. So that could be like my little walkthrough. I'll put a uh, a path and like a uh, ramp up there. I think it'll actually look quite nice. So that is fine by me. And I mean, I don't, oops. I don't need it to be absolutely perfect. So I mean, I'm not too fussed. So there we go. Um, it's so hard to see. Uh, am I facing the right way now? Yes. Uh, honestly, this might be getting towards the last few that I want to actually put over here. Uh, that is if I put them in the right spot, you know, and wow. Okay, I just go launching, I guess. Why not? It's actually easier to just do it that way. Um, oops. Uh, <laughs> I'm trying to set how many more I want to actually put down here. Because uh, I don't want to make it like so dense that I can't find my way through. Uh, but I think that there... Maybe just one more uh, literally right here. Well, maybe not literally. Oh no, that's literally where I wanted to go. Literally. Alright. There we are. I think that's going to be it. I think that's us done. Ooh, hello. <laughs> don't mind if I do. Uh, I don't know how much you're worth, but I'm very curious to see. In fact, I can bring up my little uh, spreadsheet here and check that out. Uh, so what was it? Purple something something? Right? Or was it Great Purple Emperor? Wow, that's worth 3,000. Uh, so thank you. Uh, wow. <laughs> so that's probably the most expensive bug I've caught back in, other than the tarantula and stuff, so that's really good. Um, didn't expect that to be there quite as quickly, but sure. Sure thing. Hello, Timmy. 
Uh, let's see. I'm offering uh, that. Uh, and then I think that's literally it, to be honest. I can give you some apples <laughs> if you want them. <laughs> Why not? Uh, actually, I may gift those later. Who knows? I'll keep them for now. Uh, I will give you that because I've already got one. Uh, I know it might be a different color, but still, I'll go ahead and sell that. All right. Uh, 3600 Don't mind if I do. Perfect. You know, I really love my outfit now. Uh, but drink a coffee time, of course. <laughs> That's good. Uh, but anyways, uh, you know, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm not in the video now, but just thank you in general. Um, I really do appreciate it. Um, the support, like I said before, has been, like, so good. And uh, it's still kind of... Like, I, I don't think I'm going to get used to it because it keeps, like, continually getting larger and larger every day. Um, like, I think my average views are, like, around six, 700 views now. Uh, before, I was lucky. Like, I felt pretty good about getting over 100. So, it's kind of like an intense change <laughs> in reality. Uh, so, you know, thank you for that. Um, it's made a huge difference in uh, just the ability to be able to record more and kind of the motivation to do so i mean i've never made this many episodes that i can think of at least of a single series um you know we're like over 50 odd in now uh and it still blows my mind that i've even made it this far to be honest uh because that is not my usual uh but it's really really cool <laughs> i'm very happy about it <laughs> Uh, alright, I need to, is it, I don't have fossils, I think I only have, uh, the, uh, violin beetle. So there we go, we got that. <laughs> Not a big fan, of course, but that's fine. Thank you very much. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I think, uh, what we'll do next time is, uh, we'll start messing a lot more with the... Uh, kind of upper area um, we just kind of get it cleaned out a little bit more uh, because I kind of want to make a little bit larger of an area to be able to you know put stuff like the football field in and all that uh, and I'm um, going to finish this up as well uh, tomorrow I'm going to get the little stall with the uh, proper little things installed or like kind of ready to go to not uh, but honestly, I think now I have more trees at the bottom by far than I do up here. Um, I could be wrong, but this is like so much room to do so many cool things uh, that I think it'll be really fun. Like I said, I really want to just dig straight through here, so that may happen. Who knows? I could just flatten all of this up here. I don't need a third level, at least here. I mean, I can put a third level anywhere is the thing. Uh, that's one thing I kind of forget is I can just I can I can change everything uh, Like I could just you know build it out this way instead and then have another way back there. It's hard to tell um, There's so many things that I can change that I kind of forget that I can and I limit myself <laughs> instead of letting the game limit me, but eh, Yeah, I guess it happens uh, so uh, do I want to chat with anyone first, see if they're making anything or anything like that? I don't see anyone in. Ketchup is in, though, so there's always a chance she's making something. So we definitely want to check that out just to make sure. Well, that she's not, I guess. Uh, she is making something perfect. Oh my gosh, I have such good taste. I'm a DIY trendsetter. Don't you think so, Biscuit? Uh, oh yeah. <laughs> what are you making? <laughs> Amen. Well, I'm making a log bed. I dream of the day when I fell asleep when the mag maglevs in love. Uh, it's about trains in love. One of them, hang on, not important. It doesn't matter if the maglev, <laughs> maglev might take the relationship off the rails. <laughs> because I'm building a thing. What? Biscuit, you already know how to make a log bed? Yeah, I do. But I will send it to my wife because I don't think she knows how to make that one. Uh, so that will be very good. And she's going to be famous very soon. There we go. So yeah, I will definitely send that one to Elle, uh, because she doesn't know how to do that one, so that's perfect. Uh, but anyways, uh, a bit of a short one today. Um, apologies if you wanted it longer, uh, but I got, uh, you know, I got everything I wanted to get done, actually. Uh, you know, it's pretty easy to get, I guess, like the, the basics that you want to do in a day done within like 40 minutes if you really want to. But I do plan on playing more today, and like I said, I'm going to record the Sanrio thing, so you will have another video today. 
Uh, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, thank you to all the members, and um, hopefully I've got the thing all set up for next time. Uh, but yeah, thank you guys so much. Uh, thank you for watching, and uh, yeah, goodbye.